Hi everybody, so today I'm here with, I don't know, <laughs> I really don't know, um, I guess like a planner throwback video. I asked on Instagram, on my planning Instagram for like video ideas and I actually got quite a few people suggesting I do some sort of like flip throughs of all of my old planners and I kind of felt like that was a really good idea because I do typically do, I don't think the past well, last year I didn't, but whatever. I do typically do yearly flip-throughs at the end of the year with music, and it's fast-forwarded. It's usually like a four-minute video. Um, but I never really talk about those planners ever again. Once the year is over, move on. We go on to the next, the newest and next thing. But I thought this would be a really cool idea to kind of flip back through some of my old planners. Sometimes I do do that because my planners are stored in our closet on a shelf. So sometimes when like the girls are bathing and they're already done and just kind of like playing, I'll pull one down and start flipping through it. But I don't know, I've never really gone back on my channel and really talked about these spreads. And I thought that'd be kind of fun to do like a throwback planner video. So I have all of my planners here. I have 2020, which is my cloud, which you guys see, which I probably won't even show, but I'll show you a little bit. 2019, 2018, 17, 16, and then 15. So I have four Erin Condren life planners. I have my cloud, and then this is actually a plum paper planner, which was my first ever like sticker planner that I used. And it's funny, out of all of these planners, I have only finished two technically uh, because I have not finished my cloud yet and I did not finish 2015 because I started in like February and then I didn't finish completely 2018 or 2019. 2018 because I got pregnant and got very very sick and 2019 because I got so behind that I just never caught back up. So yeah let's just kind of do this. So I'm gonna go ahead so this obviously is 2020 my aura is still cloud. This was 2019 I believe this was 2018. I can tell because half of the pages are taped together. Yeah, it's 2018. So then I would assume this would be 2017. This would be 20. Yeah, this is definitely 2016 because this is my first Aaron Condren ever. And this is 2015. So let's go through 2015 first. Oh my God, that is quite a stack. So like I said, this is a plum paper planner. I didn't have the funds to purchase an Erin Condren in 2015. I was pregnant. I actually had my baby, I had Avery in February, my baby, oh my gosh. I had her in February and I kind of got into sticker planning because obviously I was friends with Andrea and I saw she was into it really like a lot and I was like, I really wanna do that too because I would just use your average basic planner that you just write in with like pen and pencil. It could be anything from something small like this to, you know, something small. Like that's pretty much what I used. So I did end up getting this. I kind of had to be careful because I did write a lot of like personal information here at some point. Yeah, like my bank info and things like that, which is a little crazy. Um, th this was back when I was a Kirsten Lecty. Um, and I will just flip you, let's be careful here. <laughs> Oh boy, actually wait, I did kind of start this at the beginning of the year. But this is my first ever sticker spread. <laughs> January of 2015, if it will focus back in for me. Um, yikes, I have a gnat in here that only comes around when I film. I think I just killed him though, so that's great. So yeah, I guess I did fill out this entire planner. So car seat and car and pack hospital bag. I'm so sad. And then I was making like a little, like look at these stickers. Like these were Scribble Prince Co. like old school. Like the icons are kind of relatively the same, but she had little like onesies. And the, pump, the plum paper planners, these columns were smaller. So these stickers were fit for um, the Erin Contra and so they're a little bit bigger. And look at these like today's chore stickers. These are so cute upload vlog and I was selling Scentsy at this time and then I actually had washi down here too which is kind of cool so it looks like I washied all of this I was 34 weeks pregnant with Avery when I started that's wild we had been together for four years and three months what even like I, I haven't looked at this planner in a very long time actually like this is this is so bad but this was my first ever sticker planner. Look, I put a full box in, y'all. I put two in, three in. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Doctor's appointment. It's 35 weeks. 
I love these today's chore stickers. Those are really cute. Sorry, I feel like I'm just kind of staring at them because like this is just so, so new to me because I haven't looked at this in so long. I used Avery's Room Done. This is so cute. Aww. Pregnancy update. We were uploading vlogs still, so I was crazy uploading vlogs. Here's like some stickers that I got from Target. These are crazy. And then I started doing the hydrate stickers at the bottom and the little flags up top. Oh, and I was doing like deco up top too. Did I do that all of January? I think I did. I think I did that for like every month. I would do, um, what's it called? Stickers up top. Oh my gosh. Just like the one day. I, I remember doing just like the one day. That seems so ridiculous now that I think about it. But then this is when I started using stickers a little bit more. I was doing flags up top. These are old school SPC. And, oh, and then Avery was born. I remember I did the full boxes. I like pre-planned this entire week and then I she was born this day, so I put that in. Oh, my baby. First night at home, I bought this sticker sheet. This like first Valentine's Day, first night at home. I bought this sticker sheet from Michaels because like these stickers are like puffy. Like first bath, doctor's appointment. These were all like puffy stickers. I used washi like crazy. Oh, so sweet. I hope there's like no personal information in here. I don't feel like there is, but you never know, right? At least maybe in this planner there might be, who knows? And then again with the one day. This is so crazy. And then I used all green because I was following with the colors of the months. I used this massive mason jar. I believe this is SPC. This isn't. This is SPC. I don't even know what these were for, but they're super cute. I mean, I don't, I don't know. This is just, what was I doing? This was like, sticker planning was so new. It was so new, so different. I just, wow. I really like how I did this washi on the side though. That's pretty cool. I don't even know where I got that. I don't even know what half of this is. <laughs> and then the two days with the little Monsters ink stickers. These were one orange snowflake. So cute. And then this should be around the time Oh my gosh, I love this. This is so bright and so fun. And look at this washi. I used to buy from Planner Kate. She used to sell like washi strips that were shaped for the bottom, like sized for the bottom. And um, she had different designs. I Oh my gosh, if you remember from those videos, she had different designs for each month and I used to buy the pack and I would use them on like every week. Like, tell me that's not adorable. And then this is actually when I started college. Oh my gosh, and I was using hydrate stickers like crazy, but I really like this. Like, I forgot I used to buy those. These are really cute, and these like clear stickers. I, I still can't get over the fact that I bought like stickers from Michaels to use, which isn't crazy, like people still do that, but I just, I bought like these massive stickers. The little peeps up top. There's at some point we should have been visiting Austin. I don't, oh yeah, Texas. This is when we first visited Texas. So we, Andre's birthday. <laughs> We went to Avery, stayed with my mom in Virginia, and we flew from Virginia to Austin. Why did I put ATL? It's ATX. ATL is Atlanta. We were in Texas for a couple of days, and then we came back, yeah, on Monday. And then we drove back to North Carolina, and we ended up moving, like, in May. So, literally, like, a month later, we moved. Oh, I did, like, Harry Potter. That's cute. Wow. I'll go through this faster, I promise. Or maybe I won't, I don't, I really don't know. It's just so interesting to look at this spread. Like, I just, to compare it to what I do now is just wild to me, just absolutely wild. I love that I did like Harry Potter all of May. And we moved, well, this is like the packing week because I didn't obviously put anything in. I love how I was using like headers. Oh, it's so nice. We moved, yes, because I did this spread sitting at Andrea and Nick's kitchen table with Andrea. I did this spread because I started SPC this day because she made me little SPC stickers. Yeah, so I started this day. Aww. And then they literally left because they left to go to Pennsylvania like right as we got there because they were visiting last day with them. That is crazy. <sighs> Memories. Oh my gosh, look at this. My first no white space spread, almost. That's crazy. Look at the, look, this is old school. It's not even a kit. This wasn't even a kit, but like this old school SPC stuff. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh my gosh, and I was working out. Look at me go, guys. I was working out. 
These are so cute. I can't. I literally, I can't. Oh, and the two days again. I hate that I did this. I don't know why I did this. And then 4th of July, which are always like my favorite spreads for some crazy reason. Oh, these are so cute. Look at these. These are like, oh, the Taco Tuesday kit that's, or sheet that's so cute. But like here, I think this is when SPC started maybe doing kits. Kind of. They weren't really kits though. I think they were just like a couple of sheets. So maybe they were kits, but you know what I mean? I survived the stick apocalypse. That was a custom sticker because me and Nick did so many sheets. And looking back at it now, it wasn't even that crazy. But like at the time, it was so many. <gasps> oh my gosh, look at this kit. And this was all washi. Remember when I stacked up the washi, you guys? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. I can't even... And then, oh, I love this. This was not an SPC kit. I think this might have been like the first kit I tried from someone else. And then do y'all remember this kit? This was such a cute kit. Oh my gosh. And then the mermaid one. This is so intense. I remember writing on the full boxes and at the time I was like, I love this, but like this is kind of intense. The pink lemonade. I'm emotional. <laughs> These are so beautiful. And you can tell I was in a plum paper planner because this the washi doesn't fit and like everything's off because the it's so much tinier. I still love these. And then the one day. <laughs> the one day. Uh, let's see. I'll start going a little bit faster, but this is so pretty and so different. Grays. Look at this like silver kit. Oh my gosh. Wait, I got engaged this year. Ooh. <laughs> Let's get to that. That's more exciting. Let's see. Oh, so it should be next the next week. Make glitter pumpkins. We did make glitter pumpkins. Oh, and we got engaged this day. That's so crazy. Why did I use a gold kit? I don't even know. I like this heart though. And then look at this be I forgot all about this Beetlejuice spread. <gasps> oh my gosh. I love this. I love this so much. I'm definitely using the Beetlejuice kit like soon. I want to use it like very soon because I missed out on using it last year because I wasn't planning. So I want to use it again. Look at this Halloween spread. Oh my gosh, I love this. This is so crazy, but I love it so much. Like I, I love it a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Okay, so I didn't do anything here. Oh, these are so cute. Like these make me so sad because they're just so like back to like simpler times when life was normal and not weird. Like, oh my gosh, what is this vintage floral? Mm, such a good kit. And then my Thanksgiving spread. Oh, this is so pretty. Okay, hold on, hold on. And then let's get to December. So maybe I did finish. Oh, yeah, I finished this whole plan with, planner. Excuse me. And I was filming Plan With Me's at this time. So if you want to see any of these spreads, like, feel free, go back. You can watch them. Like, they're a little crazy. This was my birthday week. How old did I turn this year? I don't know. Oh, 21. I did turn 21 this year. That's weird. Oh, this was so fun. This is so cute. I can't. Look at this Christmas spread. This is so crazy. It's a little like a heft. This is a pretty hectic Christmas spread, honestly. And then this is me just like trying new things. But okay, so that was my 2015 planner. Let's go ahead and move on to 2016 when I first got an Erin Condren. I got the rose gold coil. This was the first year that the rose gold coil came out. Mine's incredibly tarnished. Like pretty badly. I was still Kirsten Lechty. I don't want to show anything. So I feel like I was writing a lot of personal information at the time in these things. Yes. So let's not show that. So first spread of 2016. Oh geez. This is like this is a thick planner. So there's 2016. Again, if you guys want to see any of these, I'm pretty sure I filmed all of these spreads. So you definitely can. Look at this donut spread. Oh my. So cute. Look at this. And then I really like this kit. This is cute too. This feels, yeah, that's washi. I was like, this feels like washi. Look at my sidebar completely stacked. This is when I used Planner Kate um, sidebar, like stackable sidebars. Super easy at the time. Still easy, I'm sure, if she has them. I don't know if she still has them. And then this kit, which was like, this is when SBC started doing like monthly color kits, if that makes any sense. Everything was like based off the monthly colors. And then I did a frozen week. I'm pretty sure, was this the week that I did the collab with Samantha Plans? Maybe, I don't remember. 
Okay, and then, oh my gosh, this is so pretty. Look at this pinks. I think this is a Shop Jessica Hearts kit. This might have been my first one ever from her. And then Avery's first birthday spread. Her first birthday was Valentine's Day themed, so. And Andre and Nick got married this day. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> that's real cute. And then she was making me little custom like countdown stickers. Eh, I'm gonna cry. These are so cute. And then this is a Nicole Lexi Designs kit. I remember that. Wow. One month until BeautyCon, two months until PlannerCon. Yeah, she was like helping me out. Oh geez, that's stuck together. Fuller House on Netflix. So cute. Okay, let's get into what, March? This spread I hated, but I, I still kind of hate it, honestly, but it's, it's an inside out spread. And then I did this one. I'm just gonna kind of go through these unless something crazy happened. ATX Planner Meetup. Shosh's first birthday. Whoa, look at this. Was this, oh no, this is like a St. Patrick's Day kit, but this was like glittery. <gasps> and we went to BeautyCon in Dallas. Was that in Dallas? We did go to Dallas. It was like a family trip. That was cute. And then, oh my, this is actually really cute. I really like this. Okay, let's get into April. Okay, so April, we have this week. I don't know why I used a bright blue <laughs> paint build too. This is cute. And then this is when we flew to IMATS. I did a lot of traveling this year. So we went to IMATS this year. And this was a travel, and we went to PlannerCon. So like we came back and then immediately went to PlannerCon in Atlanta, I'm pretty sure. Couldn't tell you. Dang. Look at this purple. This is just so like interesting to look back. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy, maybe you guys aren't gonna enjoy this video at all, but like, I think it's cool to look at stuff like this because it's been so long. This is a Crest Press Kit. This I think this might've been my first Crest Press Kit. Again, if you have any suggestions for any other videos, I do not mind, let me know. Maybe this was my first Shop Jessica Hearts Kit. I don't remember, honestly. Where was I going? Where'd we go? Why am I flying? I don't know. I don't know. One year with SPC. Oh, this kid's so pretty too. Okay, let's get into June. Oh, look at this watermelon washi. I loved the bottom washi for this. So good. And then this kit. Oh, this kid's so pretty. And then we have like another mermaidy kind of kit. And then this kit's gorgeous. Look at that. I hated writing on grass press paper because I never knew what pen to use. Wait, where was I here? Frontier, where am I flying? Museum of Natural Curiosities. Oh, this is when we flew to Utah maybe to visit my family when they lived in Utah. Guys, I don't know where I am <laughs> ever. Oh, and then we were counting down to Vegas. God, I did so much traveling this year. It's kind of crazy. Oh, <gasps> I loved this kit. Oh, it got a little smushed. So cute. And then like a summary kit, and then the Vegas week. This was so fun. Oh, it's my first Vegas trip ever. And then we move into August. This is so cute. This bloomsicle kit. I'm like, I kind of miss no white space, but also I never could do it again because like I memory plan now. So I, I, I kind of can, but like it would just be difficult. This washi is cute. And then, there's that. Oh, I kind of like the way I filled this one out. My handwriting actually looks really good this day. All right, let's get into September. Oh, that Happy Mail sticker is cute. Oh, snap. Oh, look, the date covers. Was I using date covers before? Yes, but I feel like those are like the new font. Or maybe I'm crazy, I don't, I don't know. <gasps> I love this kit. And there's this one. And then we're into October, which I got married this year, so. Yeah, I have my countdown to my wedding. Oh my gosh. Ooh, I loved this kit. Sorry, I feel like now I'm just like, I don't know. But then this was our wedding week. Oh, my little me and Brian sticker. I love this kit, obviously. So cute. We got married on a Monday, which is weird, but if I could redo this spread, I think I would, but I just don't remember anything. <laughs> Maybe I could redo this spread one day. So pretty. Oh my gosh, this kit's crazy. 
no white space is just kind of intense if you really think about it like at least this way for me now it's just kind of a lot this was cool i loved this scene and then i was counting down to go to disney like your girl was traveling we went to disney for our honeymoon and then this is super cute oh and then avery was in the hospital i forgot about that yep that sucked and then thanksgiving and then we'll move on to December, which is when we went to Disney. And then it was my birthday week. I loved this kit. I was turned 22. Oh my gosh. These are so pretty. And then this, oh my God, this Christmas spread was just so pretty. And then this kit's cute too. And that was it for 2016. Okay, sorry. I feel like I'm going really slowly, but like, oh no, the cover popped off. I'll pop that back on later because like this is a pretty thick planner okay let's get into 2017 which is when i did the like wood grain let me check again and start 2017 off on a good note so when i was using my monthlies is like um i guess what would you say like um, youtube planning i don't know how to explain it but this is the first week of january the second week Oh, the third week. So pretty. I really like looking at like birthday weeks. I think those are my most favorite. So this was Avery's birthday spread. No, this was her party spread. This was like my Valentine's Day spread because this was her birthday spread. And it's funny because I put Andrea is pregnant over here because that's when I found out she was gonna pre or she was gonna be pregnant. She was pregnant with Bennett. So we had Avery turns two. And I found out that she was pregnant. I was so excited. Gosh. So cute. All right, I feel like I've been filming forever, but these are so freaking cute. And then Avery had surgery at 6.30. What was that? Tubes? Tubes. She had tubes put in her ears, sorry. I should have elaborated on that a little bit more. I just kind of said it for myself. We went to Sesame Street Live. Is there another? No. And then we have like the Sex in the City kit because we went to New York City again for IMAX. Oh my gosh, look at this Easter kit, it's so pretty. Oh my gosh, the unicorn kit, I loved this kit. This was so cute. And then we have this kit. <gasps> Vegas spread, because I went to Vegas again. <laughs> like a crazy person. I loved this Odd Loot Princess kit. This was so cute. I did this for Disney on Ice. And then, like, the Mother's Day spread. This mystery kit, which is kind of crazy. We used it for Schlitterbahn, but, like, it's kind of crazy, but also pretty cute. And then we have this spread for Brian's birthday. Oh, it says May. I got confused there. Brian turned 23. Oh, my gosh. He's going to be 26 in, like, a month and a half. And then this kit... I love these like plain kits for no white space because they feel like they're so much calmer. <laughs> Kay and I take on the week. Oh. oh my gosh, this crest press kit. And then the Pretty Little Liars spread. Oh my goodness, because it was the Pretty Little Liars finale. Seems like eight years ago. My 4th of July spread, which are always my favorites. This week. Again, another Vegas trip. This is when I went for 24 hours, and I won a ton of money, which was awesome. And then like a 90s themed week. And then was this like a planner party? Yes, the planner party. Ooh, and this is when I started doing white space. So it went from this to like kind of trying out white space which I really liked because it was so much easier and I felt like it was so much calmer. I still, I don't know, I had a rough time with it at first, but I feel like I got like my groove after a minute. So there's this, we went to San Antonio. I really like this kit too. Oh, this looks so nice. Oh, I really like this kit too. <laughs> uh, and then Grey's Anatomy spread, which is so weird. And then this spread. We went to get to the pumpkin patch this week. 
Again, my anniversary spread. What was this? Our one year anniversary of getting married? Yeah. So cute. And then an odd loop kit again. I love these kits. They just look so good. Nightmare Before Christmas. I loved this kit. And then we're into Halloween week. And then like fall spreads. I loved this kit from Bloomsicle. Well, it's SPC, but Bloomsicle Art. Thanksgiving. Oh, I love this kit. I think I used it last year too, didn't I? Or the year before, because it was just so cute. I loved it so much. And then this was my birthday spread when I turned 23 this year. Oh, your girl was dead. <laughs> oh, so many kits that I love now that I'm staring at these. And like, this is when I started actually writing on the paper and I really liked the way it looked. I actually really like this. And look how good my handwriting was on that sidebar. And then the week before Christmas and then my Christmas spread. And that was what, 2017? 2017, yeah. So now we'll get into 2018 when things kind of started going downhill for myself because I went down a very wrong track. So this is 2018. This is the week that Allie and Jimmy got married and like New Year's week. So it was like a party week. And then oh, I just, I love looking at these. I mean, I love the way I plan now, but like looking at the way I used to write on the paper is just really nice because this was when I started like playing around with my handwriting a little bit more and I started to just kind of fall in love with it. So cute. Oh my gosh. It's February. I'm so happy. Did I finish this planner? No. Okay. Sorry. I always get so confused as to like what planners I finished and which ones I didn't. This was Avery's birthday week. I found these like planner scraps in the declutter stash at the SPC planner party and knew I needed to use it because of that full box. <gasps> and I love this kit too. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I feel like I'm just gonna keep like exclaiming how much I love certain kits, but like, I don't know, used them for a reason, didn't I? So cute. St. Patrick's Day. Oh, look at this, we went to the fair. Or the uh, rodeo, sorry. I guess it could be the fair, because we didn't go like technically to the rodeo. And then the Easter week. It's okay, we're okay. Oh, these are so beautiful. Oh, I love this spread too. Look, I, is this when I started using Simply Gilded? Yeah, I started using Simply Gilded a couple weeks ago. Have some like Clever Gal Crafts flags up here. Super cute. And this was when it was like the faux cut washi. Love. Love, love, love. Oh, this is so cute. <laughs> All right, let's move on to May. Oh my gosh, Cinco de Mayo. I love this full big full double box here. And then Mother's Day, this is when we adopted Millie. Oh, so sweet. I love this kit. Five weeks till we move. We moved into this apartment that we currently live in. And then my Riverdale kit, I've completely fallen off of Riverdale. I don't even know where I'm at anymore. <laughs> oh, so sweet. And then my parents were coming to visit. I think this week or soonish, because this is when we started to move. Brian's 24th. Did they come to visit? When did they come to visit? I think it was this week or something like that, but this is when we moved. And then yeah, my parents came to visit. So, oh, this is the week we moved and this was also Father's Day week. And this is when I was marking my periods with little stickers, so cute. Little did I know, <laughs> the Jurassic Park kit, so cute. And then July, Big Brother week. Oh, I feel I don't feel like Big Brother is gonna happen this year and I'm pretty sad about it. And we adopted Ray this day. Oh, my little baby. Fourth of July, which I love this Fourth of July spread. I love Fourth of July so much. And then Friday the 13 tattoos, first time getting those. And then the SPC planner party again. Oh, so fun. Look at that foil. Is this like the first time I used foil? Stop, is it? I think it is. Cause look, I only used a couple, a couple pieces too. <sighs> Crazy. And then, are you guys ready? The week I found out I was pregnant <laughs> with Reagan, completely surprised. <laughs> and then this is the week I started getting sick because it happens very quickly. Um, and Brian actually was traveling cause he went to go visit his mom and I stayed home with Avery and I wanted to die cause I was super sick and I, taped from what august 12th to october 15th together because didn't do a single one of those but this is when i came back <laughs> to planning 
Um, and we went to Disney. And this was our week in Disney, which oh, makes me so happy. I love this so much. And then we get into December. Nope, October. End of October, excuse me. And we get into November. So cute. Oh, this is when I started doing this. This is when we traveled to Pennsylvania because Brian's grandfather passed away and we were stuck there for like ever because it was what winter storm Avery came through and we were stuck for so long. Look at this photo kit. I haven't used a photo kit in so long and this is so beautiful. Thanksgiving. And then we're into December. Oh, this, this photo kit. And then my birthday week, how old did I turn? 24. 24, I was pregnant. We found out Reggie was a girl. Oh, so sweet. I love the little bows, so sweet. I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. I love this. Okay. I love this kit so much. This art was just beautiful. And then I taped these two pages together, but that was the end of 2018. And now we get into 2019, which you guys haven't really seen because I did not do a flip through of 2019 because once again, I didn't hardly do any, I hardly, hardly, hardly did anything. Um, here's my monthlies in case you ever wanted to see them. But this was the first week of 2019. Oh, 2020, 2019, so beautiful. I did a couple of spreads that were kind of white spacey and then I started doing like the no white space, white space. I don't know what, I don't know what it's called. This is my baby shower week. Oh, so beautiful. I feel like I just keep, keep repeating myself, but I'm just like genuinely happy with the way my spreads started turning out. And then this was last week of January. Oh my gosh, look at this kit. So cute, so cute. And then this was Avery's birthday week when she turned four. Oh. And then like my Valentine's Day ish, ish, ish spread. Baby is the size of a squash. I was 32 weeks pregnant, oh my gosh. And then, yeah, I did a lot of monthly spreads for a minute. And then I did the Star Wars spread. And then there's this spread, so much pain. St. Patrick's Day, my custom with Avery scripts, when I watched all my favorite movies. You guys have seen these, I feel like recently, or maybe not, so I'm not sure. But, and then this is my last spread that I did, like white space like this, because then I started doing bougie boxes. <laughs> so, I really like the way this turned out. There's actually only one spread I think you guys have not seen, other than like the monthlies, which first of all, oh my God, this is so cute. This is the week before Reagan came, and then this was the week she was born. I started using extenders. I have some extenders. My little baby's born. Oh, I'm emotional. And then this spread, which you guys saw, which was my Easter spread. And then I think this may, oh, this spread is gorgeous. I haven't seen this planner in a while because like I did it and then just never looked at it again. I think the only spread you guys haven't seen, you saw this one because this is when I went back to work. The only spread, Mother's Day, which I put some more of these in, or did I just do one? No, I did two. Extenders. Boop, ah, come on, boop. And then my Game of Thrones spread, and then like the Cyber, was this Cyber Monday? Yeah, spread, which I also had another extender on here. I don't think I did any other ones though. This is cute. And then my bloom spread with this beautiful washi. Yeah, so I think the only spread you guys haven't seen is this one, which was Brian's birthday spread. Um, I did this one off camera, but then I just never did any other ones. Like all of these are blank up until I came back to planning again with the frozen spread, which I still love, obviously. Um, wait, did I do? No, I did Thanksgiving, right? Oh no, Thanksgiving was next. And then there's Thanksgiving. I used an extender here. Hello. Oh, does it go up? No, it goes down. I was like, hello. And then my birthday spread, which I used extender here. <laughs> Annoyed with Brian. And then I never filled any of these out. So you see these little like notes in here because never filled them out, but they're still pretty. Eventually I'll fill them out. Here, let's move these little. Ah, I got stuck under the sticker. But this looks gorgeous. 
oh my god and then again a little extender and, and that's pretty much it for 2019 so then i'll just i don't know if i'm gonna oh i did this to the front of my planner too i don't know if i'll go through 2020 like i'll just show you briefly what i've done so far i feel like if you've been watching you've seen all of these spreads so far but it's still fun to like look through ah this one always gets stuck so there's this one i'll go fast because you guys have already probably all seen these and if you haven't definitely go back onto my channel and check them out oh i didn't do one of the other ones but whatever and here we go and i will do a flip through at the end of the year a fast one of all of these spreads because that's like my favorite thing to do it's a quick easy upload um but yeah and i still have one more spread i need to fill out which you guys will see soon here in a second <laughs> which is the spread i just uploaded on wednesday which was the baby magic spread so that is it for my like planner throwbacks i hope you guys enjoyed that uh, let me know if there's any other types of videos you would like to see. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.